Hey everyone, this is Jen from Crystal Guidance and welcome to my light box. I had a few people who were asking about my portable incense burners and how they work. Now here's the deal, I do not sell these. These just happen to be mine that I use in my healing videos. But you can do a search on places like eBay. They're 10 to $24 depending upon where you find them from. You will need to purchase butane. I was already trying to mess with the other one, which is why there's a bit of a mess there. I'm going to take it apart and kind of show you how it works. Like I said, you're going to need butane, which you put in there, but you can find it at Walmart. And I'm going to turn off the light so you guys can see the flame. So that's what's going to shoot up inside of here. Helps if I'm looking around the camera and not through it. All right, the top comes off. And that's where you can put your resins or your sage leaves, whatever you want. You can see here, I've actually got some resins in mine right now in this one. And then as you could see, there's where the flame is at. Let's see if it'll show in the bright. Nope, it's going, trust me. It's just too bright in the light here. But, screw this back in. There we go. Light it up. And the smoke comes out pretty simple, and honestly, it's so much easier than carrying around a sage stick. So, and this one, I'm not sure if you'll be able to see them. Nope, it's too dark that way. So, let me see. I'm bringing that out. Nope, still too dark. Okay, so basically, and you'll notice it does make a bit of a mess, but really not much considering. And this one. I have white sage, a little bit of lavender, palo santo, and sweet grass. That way it helps the smell to cut down on that strong, you know, white sage smell. So, as I mentioned, sage leaves. Um, I do break them up. So I use a mortar and pestle and break them up smaller just so that it fits in there easier and I can get a nice mixture. So I have that in there. Getting the smaller pieces of the Palo Santo is a whole lot easier to work with than dealing with bigger pieces. So I definitely suggest the smaller. As I mentioned, I have lavender in there. It's my lavender. You guys know how this rolls. And then I took my sweet grass and I cut it up. Honestly, smaller would be even better, but this works. It definitely adds a lot better fragrance than just the sage. So, sweet grass. Bring in those sweet energies. And you can also add resins. So, like I have frankincense, my favorite. <laughs> Copal. Myrrh. And benzoin. I actually have in my gold one over here is benzoin and frankincense for meditation blend. Um, obviously there's more that you can do than just these. This is just what I happen to have in my two little burners. So that's how these work. Again, I do not sell them. These are my personal ones, and I actually have a third one I bought so I can have my meditation blend, my around the house cleansing blend upstairs, and one downstairs. So do a search for 
portable incense burners and you should be able to find them. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If um, my local shop, because I've brought these to them and showed them and they were very interested. So if my local shop Mantra ends up selling them, I will be sure to let you guys know. So sending you all so much love and crystal blessings.